Unsupervised machine learning can help you detect anomalies in your data and forecast trends. The Elastic Observability and Security Solutions have pre-configured machine learning models right out of the box. In this video, you will see how you can get started with building your own machine learning jobs. To access the machine learning features, open the Kibana main menu by clicking the Menu button on the top left and select Machine Learning. You will see several tabs. The Overview tab provides an overview of any existing machine learning jobs. Here you can also create new anomaly detection jobs or data frame analytics jobs. The Anomaly Detection tab provides a summary of all the anomaly detection jobs that have been created and their current state. The Data Frame Analytics tab provides a summary of all Data Frame Analytics jobs. You can use these jobs for outlier detection classification or regression analysis. The Data Visualizer tab enables you to visualize a dataset. The Settings tab provides additional configuration options for your machine learning jobs. Let's create an anomaly detection job. From the Anomaly Detection tab, select Create Job. Next, select the indices you wish to use. You can create different types of jobs. Let's take a look at creating the most basic one, a single metric job. You can select a specific time range you're interested in, or run the analysis on the full data set. Next, select the metric you're interested in. Give the job a name. Finally, click Create Job. By default, the job will start running automatically. The job will retrieve a subset of the data using the data feed you've defined, and will build a model out of it using unsupervised machine learning techniques. You can run the job in real time on new data. This will help you detect anomalies as soon as they happen. Click on View Results to view the results in the single metric viewer. Use the slider below the chart to select the time range you want to inspect. The blue line in the chart represents the actual values in your data. The shaded blue area represents expected values according to the model. This range becomes more accurate as the model improves by processing more data. Data points that are highly anomalous according to the model are shown in red and the low scored values are indicated in blue. The anomalies are also listed below the chart. Every anomaly gets scored between 0 and 100. This score indicates how anomalous a data point is. Inspect an anomaly to see more information about the anomalous data point. You can see what a typical value at this time would have been. Switch to the Anomaly Explorer to view a swim lane showing the anomalies over time. You can add the swim lane to a dashboard, so you can spot new anomalies as soon as they are detected. Machine learning can be used for more than anomaly detection. Once a model has been created, it can be used to predict future behavior. Click Forecast to extrapolate into the future. This can be helpful with capacity planning, for example. Return to Overview to manage your jobs. Here you can edit and delete your jobs, and start and stop the data feeds. In this video, you learned how to create machine learning jobs for anomaly detection.